Hi, my dear students. Welcome back to my channel. Today, demo wears important questions. Uh, like uh, this are this type of question is most important formula. See, cos alpha plus cos beta plus cos gamma equal to zero, and and also equal to sin alpha plus sin beta sin gamma. Okay, then show that this three this three. Okay, you should prove here cos alpha cos three alpha plus cos three beta plus cos three gamma equal to three of cos of alpha plus beta plus gamma. Second bit is sin three alpha plus sin three beta plus sin three gamma equal to three sin alpha alpha plus beta plus gamma. Okay, cos of alpha plus beta plus cos of beta plus gamma plus cos of gamma plus alpha equal to zero. Okay, should prove this type of question. Okay, how to prove this type of question? Let us discuss now. Okay, first what is the formula? Uh, do you know this formula? Cos alpha plus i sin alpha equal to cis alpha, right? Now using this formula, you will get the easily value. Okay, yeah. Now here alpha beta gamma there, right? That's why I'm taking small a equal to cis alpha. Okay, small b equal to cis beta, small c equal to cis gamma. Okay, now add them these three all. Then what should you do? See, a plus b plus c equal to this cis alpha plus cis beta cis gamma, right? Then here cis alpha, I'm writing shall I, shall I write here cos alpha plus i sin alpha, right? Plus cos beta plus i sin beta, right? Okay, small b, small c means what? Yeah cos gamma plus i sin gamma right yeah now cos alpha plus cos beta plus gamma right real parts is uh, taken one side and uh, imaginary parts are taking another side right suppose see cos alpha plus cos beta okay plus cos gamma okay plus i take out then sin alpha plus sin beta plus sin gamma right sin alpha plus sin beta plus sin gamma okay now this is given here zero right this is given part that's why happily right here zero plus i into zero is zero right therefore a plus b plus c equal to zero right if a plus b plus c equal to zero then what is the formula yeah remember ninth class formula yeah in the polynomials right that is a cube plus b cube plus c cube equal to three a b c okay remember this formula okay a cube plus b cube plus c cube equal to three a b c okay now what is a cube a cube means this cos alpha plus i sin alpha right whole cube okay yes a cube is what cos alpha plus i sin alpha whole cube then write happily cos alpha plus i sin alpha whole cube right okay plus b is what cos beta plus i sin beta whole cube okay plus c is what cos gamma plus i sin gamma right whole cube equal to 3 yeah a is what cis alpha cis beta cis gamma okay right a is cis alpha i take off now right that's i'm right i wrote up this here okay now here power n is there then what should you do 3 alpha right cos 3 alpha plus i sin 3 alpha right similarly here cos 3 beta plus i sin 3 beta right cos gamma is what cos 3 gamma plus i sin 3 gamma right yes yes write down yes see a lot of neatly cos 3 alpha plus i sin 3 alpha cos 3 beta like that okay cis alpha is what cos alpha plus i sin alpha cos beta plus i sin beta cos gamma plus i sin gamma right now here common them cos cos terms okay means real part and imaginary part split them okay then yes see I wrote up here uh, real parts and imaginary parts just here also left side I mean right side cos of alpha plus beta plus gamma okay plus 3i into sin of alpha plus beta plus gamma okay yeah now compare them here real parts and imaginary parts then you will equal to you will prove 1 and 2 is it right just compare them real parts and imaginary parts yeah comparing real and imaginary parts then cos 3 alpha plus cos 3 beta plus 3 3 gamma equal to 3 cos of alpha plus beta plus gamma similarly sin 3 alpha plus sin 3 beta plus sin 3 gamma equal to 3 sin of alpha plus beta plus gamma okay now third bit okay third bit how to solve them see here here a is we are taking we took up here what is small a cis alpha cis beta cis gamma right neatly then root of first a equal to cis alpha p equal to cis beta right c equal to cis gamma right then what is 1 by a tell me yes cis of minus alpha right similarly 1 by b equal to cis of minus beta okay 
1 by c equal to c sub minus comma. Right. Yes, 1 by a add them now. 1 by a plus 1 by b plus 1 by c equal to what? C of minus alpha plus C of minus beta plus C of minus gamma. Right. Now, just gamma here. Okay. Then, here A plus C plus equal to 0. Right. Just here uh, taking LCM A, B, C. Okay. And here listen. Here C alpha plus C beta A plus C plus equal to 0 is given. Right. Then, C of here and also given cis alpha plus cis beta plus cis comma cos comma equal to 0, right? Cos terms are 0 and sin terms also 0, right? Then, yeah, here actually a plus b plus c equal to 0, right? That's why 1 by a plus 1 by b, 1 by c equal to 0, also 0, right? Why? Because a equal to 0, a plus c plus equal to 0, then the reciprocal is also 0, right? That's why this equal to 0. Uh, just this part, uh, take LCM first, see, ab plus bc plus C A, right, is equal to 0, therefore, A B plus B C, yeah, plus C A equal to 0, because here cross multiply them, then A B C into 0 is 0, right, this is equal to, now what is A B, yeah, A is, you know, that cis alpha, right, now cis alpha, cis beta, right on, cis alpha into cis beta, right, plus, sorry, beta, plus cis beta into cis gamma, Right. Similarly, cis comma into cis alpha equal to 0. Right. Cis alpha into cis beta. What is the formula? Cis of alpha plus beta. Right. Cis of alpha plus beta. Okay. Cis of beta plus gamma. Right. Cis of alpha plus gamma equal to 0. Okay. Now, cis of alpha plus beta. Cis of alpha plus beta means what? Cos of alpha plus beta. Right cos of alpha plus beta plus i sin of alpha plus beta right similarly here cos of beta plus gamma plus i sin of beta plus gamma right next plus cos of alpha plus gamma plus i into sin of alpha plus gamma right equal to zero now real parts equate them and real parts, I mean imaginary parts, right? Then uh, comparing on both sides, comparing on both sides, real parts and imaginary parts. Okay, imaginary means what? Yeah, in I, I parts, okay, I of I coefficients. Okay, that is imaginary parts. Real parts are equal to zero and imaginary parts also equal to zero. Therefore, cos of alpha plus beta, okay, plus cos of beta plus gamma plus cos of alpha plus gamma equal to 0, right? That is only, right? Proved, yeah. 1 and 2, 3, yeah. All I proved. Understood? A, B, C. You are taking A plus C plus C. Okay. You can take here cis alpha compulsory because 3 terms are there. Then that's why small A equals cis alpha, small B equals cis, gamma, cis beta, small C equals cis gamma. Okay. Just add them. Okay, then compare them here. Both sides, this part is 0 is given. That's why A plus C plus equal to 0 you got. Okay, if A plus C plus equal to 0, then what is the formula? Yeah, remember this formula. This formula is very important. Okay, AQ plus BQ plus CQ equal to 3ABC. Yeah, now just compare them real parts and imaginary parts. Then 1 and 2 bits completed. Is it clear? Okay, now third part. In third part is reciprocal taken. Okay, reciprocal is taken. A plus C plus equal to 0, that's why the reciprocal also 0, okay, equal to 0 then, okay, then, yeah, then here taking LCM, here AB plus BC, C A equal to 0, right, then A is what, cis alpha, cis beta, cis beta, cis gamma, like that, okay, here one, one more formula is there, cis alpha and cis beta is what, cis of alpha plus beta, okay, yeah, like logarithm formula, log A into log B is what, log of A plus B, <laughs> like that, remember that formulas, yeah, easily real parts and imaginary parts. Here asking only cos terms, okay, not uh, sign terms. That's why I stopped here only, okay. Clear, third one proved. Understood? Okay, more problems, okay, then I will upload more videos, okay, okay. Bye, all the best.